Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions Crystal Opening. We're hunting for Aegon. That's pretty much what we're doing in this video. All right, so let's warm up with one of these crystals. Quick tap it. Let's uh, just warm up the RNG. Uh, love these crystals, by the way. You can get them for free. Huh. Paragon, huh? I guess we'll open those up. I'm not a fan of them, but there's always a chance. To date, I have not gotten a single seven star out of these. All right, uh, quick tap it. And first one is gonna be, okay. Right next to a seven star. Yep, yep, yep. Let's do another one. Quick tap it. Got no time for all that mess. Hmm. That would have been messed up if I finally got Aegon, but out of one of these. Yeah, I would have been like, okay. They know I think they suck. So that's how they're going to do. All right. So we've got mutant and skill dual crystals. I already bought two of them the last time this was here. And I have enough to get a few more if we need them. Okay. So let's go ahead and let that spin out. And let me pop up the most wanted six stars here. All right. So obviously Aegon, that's who we're hunting. Um, I can awaken Void. But I already have a, a seven-star void. Would rather awaken him. Got Falcon, got um, Wolverine, and we got Spider-Man Supreme. I think I already awakened my Spider-Man Supreme. If you saw, we just got him, right? That was the five-star, though. I can't remember if I if I awakened him or not, but I don't really care. I have like nine uh, generic six-star awakening gems, so I can awaken whoever I want. All right. First one, it's going to be Crossbones. I love me some Crossbones, but he's not who we're looking for. So that is Seven Star Shards. All right, spin out another one. And we'll probably have to dip over uh, to uh, Battlegrounds and uh, see what we can do. All right. Um... But at this point in time, the only six star I really want to see is Aegon. Opened up two, two Abyss Nexus skill. Still couldn't get them. So let's see how much pain I'm going to have to go through. Because I can still do one path of Necropolis without an Aegon. But I'm not doing any exploration without him. All right. Hawkeye. Yes, they're... Uh... Let me see. Yeah, he's not even a... I... I like Hawkeye, but since they have Kate Bishop, Kate Bishop is the Hawkeye we should have had. But we get seven-star shards. Okay. So I kind of figured I was going to have to do this anyway. Let's go over to the uh, Battleground store. And we can get some six-star shards here. I'm just going to go ahead and get them. And let's open up some more. Okay, so we will grab that one. And let's see if we can finally get ourselves an Aegon. If not, the hunt will continue. Um, we have uh, some time this whole month. And we also have 
um, I guess a little bit of January because if I don't have an Aegon by like the first week in January or so, I'm just going in. And I'll go in, get one path done, and then wait until I have Aegon to go back in. So then they could take their sweet time in, in giving me an Aegon. I won't care. All right. What do we got? Can we get ourselves an Aegon finally? Nope. We got Big Boy. Big Daddy Apaco. I think I've already taken him. No, I didn't take him to SIG 200. Not that it matters. He, his SIG is garbage. It's really garbage. All right. I don't even know because, like, Kate Bishop was next. I don't even know if she is... If you need to, to get a SIG uh, level on her. I don't know how well uh, her SIG level... Uh, how good her SIG level uh, is, her signature ability is. I don't know. Hmm. But I heard that she definitely... Um, can rock in the Necropolis. Now, whether I can rock with her is another story. Um, but I don't know. Uh, Zemo, I heard he's also good. So I might use him. But I'll, I'll do my research. I'll, I'll look around and see what people are using and, and that kind of thing. All right. Who do we got here? I don't even see Aegon. He's not even coming around to say hi to me, you know? Um, but, yep, yeah, more seven-star shards. We're good. We're good. And I guess this is going to be the last one here. Yeah, last one. And see if we can get him there. Let me see. I know he doesn't need to be in the real, but it's nice to see him there. You know, at least you know. You're like, oh, hey. I see him waving at me. Maybe he gave me a wink. I don't know. But it's all good. We will keep trying to get him. We'll get him eventually. Uh, the banquet event. There's a chance to get him there. Because I believe there is a Nexus crystal there. So we could possibly get him there. So we shall see. We shall see. All right. Last uh, crystal for the video. And the last one's going to be still no, not even a hint of an Aegon. They're going to really drag this out, I think. The last time for the five-star Aegon, I think I ended up opening 50 or 60 of these dual class crystals and then finally ended up getting him cyber weekend in a nexus that's how they seem to want to do me anyway that's cool we got more uh seven star shard man he's almost sig 200 and that's all natural y'all let's see how many do i have all right 35 so we're not really any anywhere near our next seven star all right but anyway that is going to do it. The hunt for Aegon will continue, which I kind of figured it would. Uh, take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.